The Legend of Sanctus. Long time ago, there was a six-year-old child that lived near the lake with his family. His two brothers are full of excitement and enjoyment even though they are poor. Andres was a naughty child who is always hiding from his parents without asking for permission to go outside their house. But for Andres, he enjoys watching his brother finding Andres anywhere and even his mother and father is worrying about Andres. If his brothers are very tired in finding Andres, and his parents are almost crying, then that's the only moment Andres will reveal himself to his family with a huge and creepy smile. At first, when Andres kept hiding from his family because he enjoys him, his family are very afraid of what might happen to him, and they are very worried. But after several times of his redundant hiding, his parents became a little angry. Then his seventh birthday came. His parents and brothers are very busy. His mother and father cook tasty foods that some kids who have been invited will join Andres in his party, while Andres' brothers are busy in decorating the venue. While Andres was out of their sight, Andres thought to joke around and hide away from his parents and brothers again. Unfortunately, Andres got very far while he was finding a place to hide. He was lost and he never got the chance to get back to their house. When the time came to start Andres' birthday party, they can't find him again until his visitors got bored and went home. His parents were very angry, and one of his brothers got very upset, and he wished that he wanted a dress to be huge and wide filled. Please make a dress a one big and wide filled, so if the sun will come up until we fell to sleep, he will never be out of our sight. In order to see him, when we go outside of our house. Also, he will be taken care of very well by the seasons of hot and cold, his brother said eagerly. Then suddenly, an old man came. He was speaking a peculiar foreign language, saying, San Andres! San Andres! which meant to help Andres family in locating Andres. From that moment on, the field was called San Andres Buki, until people came and filled that place. It is now called San Andres Bukid Manila.